Hey guys, I want us all to look at Zuckerberg's biography and what he has been able to achieve since 2004 till date 2023. Hello, let's go. The desire to stay connected with your friends and family is, I think, a relatively universal thing across the world. Mark Elliott Zuckerberg, born May 14, 1984, is an American business magnate, computer programmer, internet entrepreneur, and philanthropist. He co-founded the social media website, Facebook, and its parent company, Meta Platforms, formerly known as Facebook Incorporation, of which he is executive chairman, chief executive officer, and controlling shareholder. Zuckerberg attended Harvard University, where he launched Facebook in February 2004 with his roommates Eduardo Savrin, Andrew McCollum, Dustin Moscovich, and Chris Hovis. Originally launched in only select college campuses, the site expanded rapidly and... Zuckerberg started his own competing website. When Tyler and Cameron Winklevoss and Divya Narendra read into Harvard Crimson about Face Bash, they hired him. But within a few weeks, Mark's interest flagged and he decided to pursue his own interest, which was the Facebook. Zuckerberg dropped out of college his sophomore year and devoted himself full time to Facebook. By the end of 2004, Facebook had one million users. A lot of what we know about Mark's character is that he does like to have this great control. He's very confident in what he sees happening. He's very confident in what he's created. And I think you see that in the way Facebook operates even to today. Facebook opened its door to more schools, increasing its membership to 5.5 million in 2005. And one year later, Zuckerberg rejected a $1 billion offer from Yahoo to sell his company. I think Mark never was going to sell that company. Zuckerberg took the company public in May 2012 with majority shares. In 2007, at age 23, he became the world's youngest self-made billionaire. He has since used his funds to organize multiple philanthropic endeavors, including the establishment of the Chan Zuckerberg Initiative. Zuckerberg has been listed as one of the most influential people in the world on four occasions in 2008, 2011, 2016, and 2019, respectively. ...by the creators of Harvard Connection and forced to pay a settlement of $65 million, an event fictionalized in the Golden Globe Best Picture film, The Social Network. The Winklevoss brothers apparently felt that Mark had stolen their idea. He denied it, and they settled out of court, so we'll never know. In 2010, Time Magazine named Zuckerberg Person of the Year, and on May 18, 2012, Facebook entered the stock market as the biggest tech IPO in history, but failed to live up to expectations. This was a company that was on the hottest ride going. When it hit the stock market, though, you know, reality does sink in and everybody looks at the numbers. Now they have to get down to the business of building a business. As of March 2012, Mark Zuckerberg was listed as the world's ninth most powerful person by Forbes magazine and has more than 900 million active users on Facebook. Facebook has become the way we socialize today. And as a result, it has become a mother load of information that every advertiser in the universe would like to have access to. Facebook generated $3.7 billion in 2011 and this is just a small amount of money compared to where it will be in the future. 